he built the world's most successful electric car company, Tesla. Lift off. And the company SpaceX, which just launched astronauts into orbit. Now Elon Musk is embarking on another equally challenging mission, hacking the human brain. I think it's going to blow your mind. Musk's new venture, Neuralink, will implant this device into a patient's skull. It's kind of like a Fitbit in your skull with tiny wires. Neuralink aims to make the procedure automated, with this robot cutting an incision in the skull and inserting the device. The robot has already done surgeries on pigs like Gertrude, who's had the chip for two months. The, the beeps you're hearing are real-time signals from the Neuralink in Gertrude's head. So this Neuralink connects to neurons that are uh, in her snout. So whenever she snuffles around and touches something with her snout, that sends out neural spikes. By putting a pig on a treadmill, Neuralink showed how the brain chip was able to predict the pig's joint movements, which look, compared to the actual movements, almost exactly the same. Musk says they're working with the FDA to move toward clinical trials with humans. The number one target is spinal cord injury. If you can sense what somebody is trying to do with their limbs, what they want to do with their limbs, then you can actually do a second implant that's at the base of the spine or, or wherever, just after wherever the spinal injury occurred, and you can create a neural shunt. So I'm confident that long term uh, it will be possible to restore somebody's full body motion. So if somebody even has a severed spine, they will be able to walk again. Somebody that, that's got mental de degradation, quadriplegic, uh, bipolar, um, uh, insanity problems, I mean, things that their life is so miserable, it is worth taking a risk like this to end the misery. That's the target audience for this initially. Uh, it may eventually evolve into something that we might all have for computer interfaces, but we're decades off from that. Musk answered questions about moving even deeper into the brain and predicted the technology could lead to someday replaying memories. Everything that's encoded in memory, you could upload. You could basically store your memories um, as a backup and restore the memories. And ultimately, you could potentially download them into a new body or into a robot body. The future is going to be weird. <laughs> Musk says Neuralink will probably be quite expensive when it's first launched, but he expects the price to drop rapidly over time. He says eventually it'll be down to just a few thousand dollars, including the surgery. And he compares it to a LASIK eye procedure where you'll be able to go in, have the chip installed in your brain, and then head home the very same day. Mark New, CGTN, Sunnyvale, California.